Hi, I'm David Gow and I'm wearing this lovely t-shirt today for one very simple reason, to try and help save the rhino. Sounds dramatic, but this campaign is targeted specifically at Vietnam, hence it says down here somewhere, save the rhino Vietnam. Now, let me explain. What's happening is basically appalling. There are something like three rhinos every day being killed for their horn. Now, three a day might not sound much, especially if you're a smoker. It's nothing. But if it's a rhino you're talking about, it's an enormous amount. Because if you think about the rhino population across the world, it's not that great. If you think about the maths, it means that well over 3,000 rhinos a year are disappearing simply because of the things on the end of their nose. And that is just dreadful. Even in places like, for instance, South Africa, formerly thought of as something of a, a safe haven, over 1,000 there last year were killed, again for their horns, and for the worst possible reasons. Now, the reason we're targeting Vietnam is Vietnam is a specific user, a high-end user, if you want to put it that way, of the end product, part of the pun. And what happens there is that people believe silly things. They believe, for instance, that you can cure a hangover with ground-up rhino horn. It's keratin. It's the equivalent, put it this way, of taking your toenail clippings or your fingernail clippings, putting them in a blender, putting them in a glass of water, stirring it up, take that down, and that's your hangover cured. It is just rubbish. And the other thing, of course, that they're doing as well is using rhino horn as status symbols, as gifts, maybe business partner to business partner. Again, not understanding that that simple gift costs you an entire rhino. It costs you a major proportion of an extraordinary species. So this campaign is designed to educate those in Vietnam, to try and spread the word, to try and stop people wanting to buy rhino horn for these ridiculous, spurious reasons. And uh, Say the Rhino is going to work with those in Vietnam to try and educate them, to try and spread the word, and try and do everything they can to stem the demand and thereby stem the killing. So it's a great thing they're trying to do. It's a wonderful species they're trying to say. If you buy one of these t-shirts, these lovely t-shirts, you'll be entered into the draw. Uh, this one has been signed. I've said something like, I love these horny beasts, David Gower, and you'll have a chance to win that. If that means anything to you, fantastic. If you just want to save, save a species, please do. Be much appreciated.